Hi, I'm Paul Stringfellow, guest host for Pop-Up Tech Talks here at NetApp Insight Bill in 2017. I've got another guest. Hello, guest. Hey. Hi. How are you? I'm, I'm great. I'm actually in the middle of dessert. I, I got a few minutes, though, for you. Just That's for you. great. So why don't you tell us who you are and then tell us what's in your dessert? I am Justin Parisi. I'm a technical marketing engineer here at NetApp. I deal in flex groups as well as ONTAP. And in the dessert is a delightful New York cheesecake. That does sound, sound, sound very, very delightful. But is it more delightful than what's new in ONTAP 9.3? That's debatable. I'm going to go with no. Uh, ONTAP 9.3 will be more delightful for you than this cheesecake here. Uh, so in ONTAP 9.3, we're introducing a number of things to address simplicity, security, data mobility, uh, as well as performance. So we'll start off with performance. Uh, in ONTAP 9.3, we've increased performance up to 30% with some improvements in the waffle optimizations. Uh, iSCSI performance is much better because we've parallelized iSCSI. Uh, and Can I ask about oh, waffle, waffle optimization? Yeah. Is that anything to do with desserts as well? Um, well, I was in Belgium and I did eat waffles and I, I optimized many of them. Uh, but no, nothing to do with that in ONTAP, I'm sorry. Good work, carry on. Okay, uh, so in addition to the performance improvements, we have security improvements such as multi-factor authentication. So you can log in to your cluster with a username and password and then also it requires a key using an identity provider. Uh, we'll start off supporting Shibboleth and Microsoft Active Directory Federation services. Uh, we also have improved NetApp volume encryption to allow you to use the offboard key management. Uh, this allows you to simplify your environment by using existing key managers or to implement greater security because it can support higher level of FIPS compliance. Uh, in addition to that, snap lock improvements include uh, legal hold. So if you have a court order to hold on to data for whatever reason, uh, you can set this legal hold to an indefinite time until you set it to delete. Uh, you can do event-based retention for data. So if an employee leaves the company, you don't want them to delete things as they go out the door. Uh, this event-based retention will keep that data in place. We also have added the ability to do uh, volume, or sorry, file append. So if you have an audio or, or a video file, you can protect those audio and video files and append to those files as you stream. Uh, this is kind of like you know CDR technology. I mean, we're bringing it back. So it's always good to bring things back. Absolutely. So working on a dessert, it sounds like on tap nine three a smorgasbord of great stuff. I'm not done yet, Stringy. There's so much more. There's so much more. Carry on. Okay. So uh, we have adaptive QoS that'll simplify your performance. So as you grow your volumes, your IOPS per terabytes will grow with it automatically through on tap. We've added automated deduplication scheduling, so as you ingest data, ONTAP will figure out what the best dedupe schedule for you is, and then adjust your schedule based on that. In addition, inline aggregate deduplication, which came in ONTAP 9.2, has been improved so that when we uh, schedule deduplication jobs, we can actually schedule aggregate deduplication after the fact. So you can do it inline as well as on disk after the fact, because you know, as we do inline, sometimes we favor performance and we don't deduplicate everything. So you'll get better storage efficiencies in ONTAP 9.3 as well. Um, flex groups have improved. I'm a Flex Groups TME as well. So we've added QTrees, we've added Snap Vault, we've added Antivirus, we've added Change Notify support for SMB. Uh, we've also added the support for uh, independent version Snap Mirror. So we've improved the Snap Mirror engine for Flex Groups. Um, so yeah, quite a bit of stuff in ONTAP 9.3 that we've added. For, for, oh, I for almost forgot the, uh, the, new, the coolest thing. Uh, the data fabric mobility piece. So we actually added another thread to the data fabric with ONTAP to, or sorry, SolidFire to ONTAP Snap Mirror. So you can actually Snap Mirror your SolidFire systems to your ONTAP systems to protect your SolidFire data and fail back in the event of a disaster. So you can actually fail back your systems and, and you know restore everything and then get back up and running like you could before. So. so to do all that work, add all those great new features into ONTAP since the last release, what, 9.2, uh, how long has that taken? That sounds like there's a good two years working there. It feels like two years, but in actuality, we've reduced our cadence in ONTAP and starting in ONTAP 9 to every six months. So you can expect all that feature goodness every six months from NetApp. Uh, we'll get new features every six months, so expect the next version of ONTAP in six months from now. And then around inside of next year, expect the next version for that. So you're going to get a lot more feature functionality as we build onto the existing features, because we're actually using the features we have as building blocks to improve other things in the OS as well. So talking about feature beauty and feature goodness, the big Insight 2017 question is, curry-versed or brat-versed? 
Oh, bratwurst by far. I, I tried currywurst, couldn't do it. And as everybody knows, bratwurst is the wrong answer. Justin Parisi, thank you very much. Well, I have a question for you now. Who has the best podcast near you? The correct answer is, of course, me. Uh, so thanks for, thanks for coming in and thanks for plugging it. Right, okay, absolutely. Thanks for listening to Pop-Up Tech Talks. Come and, come and join us again for another episode real soon. Yeah.